Hey guys, Dax here out in Milwaukee, uh, home of Harley Davidson, uh, bringing you the first little segment of what we're going to offer uh, with with the, the annual dealer meeting here. Um, here we are with the Lab Wire. Uh, for those who don't know, we are going to be the only dealership in Western Pennsylvania offering this right out of the gate. We're so excited. If you have questions, you need to call us. You need to email. We're ready. Uh, Doug and I just completed our uh, jump start on these, so. They say they don't want you to whiskey throttle. That thing is instant power. Uh, over here, we're going to be heading over to a, a test ride. Hopefully, we'll get some footage on that. You can see the excitement in the air. Dealers, we've all been waiting a year. Hopefully, a lot of customers waiting a year for these things to go live. Uh, we're going to have a lot to offer this week. Harley is going to launch all their 2020 products from parts, clothing, motorcycles. We can't wait. Stay tuned because tomorrow, we're going to get most of that information. Um, the show essentially starts right around 9.30, so uh, might be some Facebook Live. We'll definitely have some video footage. But uh, just a little bit, we're going to be riding the lab wire, so uh, we'll share you our first thoughts, and uh, hopefully you'll see us getting on the road. Thank you. Hey guys, about to get an overview here of the bike. Come on in, let's check this out, our first look. Start the bike up, switch the run button to on. As soon as it uh, comes up on screen, to get the bike running, press and hold the start button. As soon as you see zero miles an hour, you see the green bars on the side and the green icon there, you are live. So at this point, make sure nobody touches your throttle. You know, We don't want to have anybody go for a ride. Um, we have had that happen, so it's, it's important because it, nobody can tell that the bike is running at this point. To turn it off, you can hit the What he's saying is kickstand up, throttle is live, and it's not running, so they've had incidences where people have hit it, so if you're going to be on one, it's your responsibility. Or keep the kickstand down to be safe. Change and experience. Turn my screen off here. Um, the first one is a road mode. Um, it's kind of a well-balanced, it's about 80% power. It's got moderate regen, so it's just kind of an around-the-town balanced mode to, to ride. The next mode is sport, so it's the, uh, the S icon. Uh, that one's going to have all the power available. It's going to have a little bit more regen, uh, so it gives you more of a sense of engine braking as you're riding. Rain mode is the next mode that's uh, going to have power cuts. It's going to, you know, so you won't notice as much power as you're getting on the throttle. It's also going to have very little regen, so it's all about keeping the rear wheel engaged with the pavement. Uh, eco mode is the next one, so you get the little leaf icon. That one's going to have a little less uh, throttle input, uh, but it's also going to have the highest amount of regen. So if you want to experience regen, that's what that's going to be. Uh, we have three customizable modes that are in there. So those are settings that are available is uh, the regen level, you can set that, um, throttle input, power available, and there's three levels of traction control. So the traction control varies with these CAN modes where like sport <laughs> mode is going to give you a little bit of slip, but rain mode is going to be real aggressive and it's going to interact real quick. Um, to switch through these screens on the side here, use the joystick over here, and you push it that way it's going to toggle through anything on this side. Uh, so you get to the next screen here, is, uh, it's going to show you like, how much throttle and regen you're, you're giving the bike. You also see that there's bands that tell you which, you know, what the limits of mode that you're in are. As you switch modes, you press the mode button, it's automatically going to switch it to that screen while it's switching and it's going to go back to the, the screen that you had on. As you can see now that I switched it to road mode, you know, the limits have changed a little bit. Sport mode is going to turn you know, the limits for power off. So it's kind of a neat screen there. Other screens that are available, you've got a range calculator, an economy calculator, uh, temperature screen, uh, phone screen, and then you know, if you just want to clean, turn it off, you can turn it off. Uh, if you flip the joystick the other direction, you're going to get through the odometer. Uh, here's where you'd see turn-by-turn -turn navigation, um, and then off. Uh, if you have a phone paired and you're listening to music, it's going to show uh, whatever song you're listening to, it's going to scroll across your screen, that kind of stuff. So those are the different modes and, and the different things on the screen that you would see. Um, if you've got any questions, I can certainly answer, otherwise we've got the moments of no different music over there. 
You can switch mode while you're riding. Yes, you can switch modes while riding. So no need to stop. Uh, the only thing you can't do is change, like customize modes, that kind of stuff. Anything in the settings menu will be locked out while riding. That's not gas, people. So we're back, and uh, you know, you always hear my mouth. So I'm gonna let Doug talk. We haven't even talked yet about our experience. So uh, what do you think? Completely badass. Blew my mind away. The ex throttle response, the acceleration, the handling, everything I thought it would be, and way more. Really excited to get them into the dealership to actually take them out on the road to experience them in a real life situation. Uh, and anybody thinking about one you have to try to ride one they're amazing machines yeah yeah i i really couldn't say it better uh the, the five mile test ride leaves you wanting more because we're here in downtown yeah. milwaukee york hitting those you know curvies as much as you'd like but you can tell it's incredible it, everything is now yeah the response yeah. and the brake yeah. the, the gas you know you know you call it gas the accelerator the the handling it is so nimble for those who know me, I, you know, before Harley, I, you know, I owned a handful of sport bikes, Doug did yeah. too. So we aren't, we aren't just Harley guys, we're motorcycle guys. Holy cow, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's that good. So uh, yeah, that was awesome. Yep. We'll be back with more. <laughs>